Okay, can you sing to him? No. Come on, do it. A little B man, yeah. <laughs> okay, you hear that? Was it because you laughed? No, it wasn't. Okay. Do you guys hear that little wishing sound? Look, watch. Hey, pal. <laughs> it is because you, it's because you move. Yeah. Mom, will you please sing to Bryson, please? <laughs> Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Let's sing him a uh, let's sing him a lullaby. No, I don't know any lullabies. Yes, you do. I, I do know one. Ninety nine bottles of beer on the wall. Ninety nine <laughs> bottles of beer. Yeah, I love you. I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> You're so Hey, yeah. how are you? I'm supposed to be dropping her off. Can I take me back? Come on. Her off. Oh my god. Where are we supposed to be going? Can you take me back, please? Yeah, yeah. I'm lost. Where do we go? Do you know how to get there? Yes. Okay, so we got to go on a little field trip here. And we can't go through the other doors because they're exit only. So we're going to go through the main entrance. And I'm going to say that I'm dropping off a new patient. <laughs> From a completely random, oh shit, a Red. completely, a completely random hospital, and we're gonna see what they say. Hi, Lexi. You gotta go around the corner. Read the signs or ask somebody. Yeah, very good. That's pretty good. <laughs> Sit and leave it. Thank you. I'm here. Don't do it. I'm watching you. Okay. Oh, <laughs> uh, hey, babe. With your own people, you do what the fuck you want. I'm going to rip this guy <laughs> you want, dog. I'm going to say fuck you and your own boys. This is sugar booger, bitch. I have a picture that we will put in the screen. I didn't want to do a video, but nurses rushed in put oxygen tanks on. They didn't have a tree, so they needed to get a tree. We learned that that is a component that connects the oxygen through the cord. So necessary to get what we've got now, which is oxygen. She doesn't feel like talking. So I'll tell you kind of what's going on. Okay, so let me get my hat. Okay, so today is 30 weeks, one day. Sunday, the 15th of May, which is our anniversary. Cabo San Lucas, four years ago, baby. Let's go. Anyways, today she had some bleeding complications, right? So they ran some tests and did all that. And they're like, okay, we're gonna go ahead and give you magnesium. Now, us folks have done some research and we knew that, Matt, we know that being present tense now. I know you're watching it, you know, in the future of when we film this, but regardless, we know that when you give magnesium, it kind of indicates you may be going into labor in the next 24 hours and or to help with eclampsia. We don't have pre, we don't have eclampsia. Eclampsia is a 5,000, we're at 400, okay, our units. So we have some wiggle room there. Third, it also helps with contractions. She ain't got no damn, she ain't got no contractions. So kind of put two and two together, not to mention when you walk in the room on the door, there's something that's called a bear a bear hugger or something like that. Again, us folks did some research and that is something that you use during surgery to keep your body temperature like normal and standard. So with all that said, it's about 10 o'clock PM. She went up to go, go to the bathroom and do her thing. And she was like, oh, I can't, you know, I'm dizzy. So it's like, I gotta sit down. She's like, I'm, I feel like I'm gonna faint. So call the nurse. So we call the nurse. Nurse comes in they check everything. They're like, okay, let's do this. And then they're like, all right, we need to put you on oxygen and do all this because she was having a hard time breathing. So what they think is her magnesium levels are high. They gave her six milligrams, um, which I think four is kind of your, your range that you want to do. And she's not the biggest person in the world. So we'll leave that there. So they ran a stat test and they drew blood. So here we are. We're waiting on the results. She's got oxygen. We feel like the window's closing. And we're so happy and thrilled to meet our son. But... Every day that baby stays in is three less days in the NICU. Now we are anticipating time in the NICU. How much time? Can't tell. I don't have a crystal ball. We're not Greek gods here, okay? How you feeling? Thank you. I am your father. She's so, she's so hot, dude. <laughs> so hot. Oh, by the way, do you see that name tag right there on that pregnant lady? It's Bryson. What? What are the odds? I have the children. 
Yeah, you can see the you can see the tag. You can't read it. Huh? Bryson. Wow. Well, all this is going on. Everything she's stable. Everything's fine. We're supposed to be like a lunar eclipse, blood moon, and I've walked around everywhere. I even went to that parking garage all the way on the top, and I just can't see the moon. It's not about like the visibility with the weather or things, but it's the, the structures blocking everything. So, wow, I found it. That is cool. This is amazing. It's May 25th, 11.06 p.m. I'm sorry, May 15th. I'm having so much fun with you right now. <laughs> they just gave us masks. It is May 18th right now. The mask mandate is in full effect here at the Methodist Hospital again. We have not left the room in probably 10 or 11 days. Is it allergies? But you know what? I'm gonna take her into the parking garage. I'm gonna take her to the roof. I don't wanna go to the parking garage. All right, bye. We're going to the roof. Yep. Still moving. I don't know if you can see You can it. see it if you like stare at your belly button. It's just moving all over yeah. the place. After the uh, Lebeda law, almost every night like clockwork. Tough girl. Okay, thank you. Okay, go ahead. Do I need to come over here? Yeah, get in there, sure. <laughs> Um, they just told us that we officially are June 11th at 10 a.m. for the C-section. Oh my gosh, mm -hmm. look how exciting! Oh, That's so Saturday. Exciting. I can't yeah. really... Oh my gosh! I got Chad and Chase's birthday party, though. <laughs> he was mad that it was going to be on a Saturday and not the next Monday. Dude, today. Saturday's my layout day, and we're going to a pool party. Okay, well this day's going to be way better with a baby. Hello, hey, let me see your feet. What? I want to see them. Uh, yeah, that'll do. Okay, I need you to start an Only OnlyFans, okay? Because it's been six weeks now, and these bills ain't paying themselves. Okay, see ya. Hi, this is Miss Moffat in room 241. Hello. Hello. I knew, I did. <laughs> oh, I can keep a secret. Bite number two. <laughs> Y'all should have seen the first bite. <laughs> We got McDonald's in the house today. We said, you know what? With everything else going on, let's just eat what you want. <laughs>